Hello, it's Kimberly, Burley Kim 37. This will be my first tutorial. I thought I'd show you how to make these little um, charms that you can hang on your books. The things that you, items that you need are you can use any kind of um, plastic fragment. But I use the Tim Holtz Ideology. Right now, at your local Michaels, they have these on clearance. If you, um, just a little tip for you. Anyways, they come in. I've got one open already. They come in all different sizes. They even come with um, two of these big ones you can make a book with. This size, this one. Get the little ones. Okay, what I've got, you need glossy accent by Ink Essentials. It's by Ranger. And paper, printed paper of any kind. Um, I had this, um, purchased this a while back, and I had already made a couple that f actually fit the frame. And it's double sided. So when you do it, here I'll show you this one. When you do what I'm going to show you, you'll have a picture on both sides. You can use um, two pieces of paper. You can use one on the bottom. And then, you know, I glue them together so you have a picture on both sides. The way you do this, the first, first things first. I'm not going to be using this one for a charm because it's bigger. I'm just going to be um, adding it to um, a book. No, I think I should use this charm. Use a Dremel to drill a hole in it. You can either do it beforehand or you can do it after. I do it after because I, I, I decide where I want to put it. Like this one here, I've got a hole here, here, and here. And I'm gonna have hanging charms off of it, and then I'll be—I'll probably make a necklace out of this one because it's a little bigger. And what you do is you take your glossy accent and you put it all over your plastic piece. I hope you can see this. Get this started. say not to shake it, it'll give bubbles. But you're going to fill this whole thing up. And you can like move it around with the tip to fill it in. Or squeeze more out. I just keep going back and forth till I get full covered. I went over the edge there a little bit. Don't need to completely cover it because you're going to um, stick this right on top. Now this is a little bit bigger than the actual um, piece but what I'll probably be doing is trimming it off but I want to be able to see how I want this if I want the whole shoe or all the chicken shown the little chickies it looks like I have a bubble in there Let's see if I can work that bubble out The more you move it around, the more act active the glue gets. And you just let it sit for a few minutes. I'm going to um, pause. 